were part of the um, were a part of the Blackwood Confederacy. Uh, our language, uh, the Blackwood language, but the uh, original name uh, the Blackwoods had is, uh, were Nichitapis. Everything we do revolves around the earth. Like we, we always give thanks to to everything, like the rocks, the, the water, the, the sun, because um, the sun brings life. We thought we were just praying to the sun, but we were praying to what was behind the sun, the, uh, the great spirit. Anthony Hende, in 1796, was the first white man to ever come in contact with the black people. And when he met us, he wrote back home to the queen and he told the queen those are an aristocratic people because they have horses, you know. And so it was through um, other interpretations that we became uh, savages. So the world is backwards, you know, we're not. You know, everybody, we're moving ahead, but you know, the outside world who don't know us, see us as you know, those uh, noble savages, you know, and we don't know anything, we, we, uh, we're, we're all good, but, you know, we, we moved ahead, you know, more. well, it's like the United States, look at that. Uh, Very proud to be from my culture, as many others are. Um, unfortunately, some of our identity was lost, you know, with, um, you know, different things that have happened since, um, I guess, since we've been colonialized. <laughs> so, um, we've lost a lot of our culture, our language, as a result of residential schools, policies of assimilation, but, however, you know, some of it's been maintained. Um, Today, the majority live like modern, you know, like every Canadian. The older generation, they still have some of the old ways of our language, of, um, you know, some of the cultural practices we do. Um, however, they were raised in a very, um, once residential school was over, um, you know, the government introduced a very social dependent type of um, system into the communities. And so, you know, and a lot of times they're stuck in those, you know, dependency ways because that's how, you know, they were, they were raised and brought up and that's all they knew. The younger generation have been more educated. Um, you know, they've been off out of the community. They've, you know, rented, they've owned homes, they've worked off. You know, our, our problem has been, you know, just lack of innovative thinking. So I really see in, la in being stuck in this dependent um, way of thinking um, and, vic you know, feeling as a victim. But with the new generation coming up who, who view things differently, you know, I think I'm hoping that we start to become more independent, more economically independent and you know, become our own, do how we used to be, as we used to, um, you know, we, we, we took care of ourselves.